Mais monsieur, dis-moi, vous voulez pour me faire encore content. Au cas de la pour moi, dans la langue, pas là. Moi, je voulais dire oui, sauce pra, sauce pra son. Et mélanger au puis bon moi venir mettre dans la là pas besoin de bailler dans 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 petit assiette c'est pas on met bam tout ensemble Welcome to the Edor Style channel. My name is Amador. These are the ingredients I will be using for this vegan twist on a classic Haitian legume recipe. Look at this parsley. I've nurtured this parsley at home. Fresh ingredients can really make a difference. You're just a little proud, you know, because you grew it. While the heat is on medium, I add my onions, sun-kissed dried tomatoes, on some cold pressed olive oil. I'm going to be using half a square of this. Now, this is my way of making this unique twist on the legume recipe. I added some water and vegetable stock, some eggplant, chopped onions, cabbage, carrots, bell peppers, more onions and spices. It will simmer on medium heat for 20 minutes. And this is how it looks now. I give it a gentle smash to retain texture, but not too much so it's not like baby food. I add tomato paste, garlic, lime juice, Himalayan salt, Vegeta seasoning, thyme and onion powder. I add more carrots and bell peppers for the texture and top it with spinach, parsley, and watercress. And a bit more of Vegeta all-purpose seasoning. I let it simmer on low heat for another 15 minutes. And this is how it looks. And I add some lemon juice. Well, half of it, at least. <laughs> As for the rice, I start by sauteing green onions, garlic, vegan butter. That will stop the garlic from burning. I like the way I'm feeling. To intensify the color and deepen the flavor, I add tomato paste. Time. Vegeta Himalayan salt and vegetable stock. To make it super tasty, I will start with a little water before adding the rice. It will make it very flavorful before adding 
extra water and the rice. I usually have to remove some water because I overdo it, but you basically want to see the rice through the water. And when the water is boiled, I then add the washed rice. The way I wash my rice is over the strainer and I just let the water pour until the water is completely clear. Work smart, not hard, you know? <laughs> I also added some lentils for protein and extra flavor. With the spices in, the rice simmers over high heat and as the water evaporates, I check to make sure, you know, all of the water is gone and then I let it sit on low heat with the lid on for a final 15 minutes. Voila, my delicious and nutritious Haitian legume and flavor rice. The best part is if you have hormonal issues, fiber, things of that nature, this is a meal you can still enjoy. It's not something you should add like, you know, every other week just because of the oil consumption and things like that. However, it can be added into your diet. I have this once in a while, but it is time consuming, so I choose when to do it. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye! Hey, you talking about we alive? You speak French now. It's after 3 a.m. I know that's asking a lot of you right now. All they ever say is come and see me for once.